ADOT strives to be a good environmental steward, and we do that a number of ways. We take the environmental factors into play when we're designing a new construction project. And we're also looking at mitigation measures to avoid negative impacts to wildlife. Once an animal has been listed as threatened or endangered, there are very specific requirements that go into place. If an animal is not on that list, we have something else in its place. It's called the Candidate Conservation Agreement. The Candidate Conservation Agreement allows our agency to partner with other agencies to help come up with strategies to mitigate any kind of negative impacts. And it's just a really great tool for us to help manage that animal to try and help its recovery for its population. For the desert tortoise, ADOT would be doing tortoise inventory to determine presence, absence, relative abundance of those animals. We'll do things like mitigation fencing for tortoises, very common, and what we try to do is build a fence that's low to the ground, obviously, that follows the contours of their habitat, and it really prohibits the animals from crawling out onto the road. And then we would try to incorporate things and features into our designs so that the tortoise would be able to go underneath, and that could include things like box culverts, which not only allow for drainage, but allow those animals to move. The Desert Tortoise Conservation Agreement had a large role in preventing desert tortoise from being added to the list of threatened or endangered species. When we're collecting data on species locations, we're going to share that data not only with the Arizona Game and Fish Department, but with the Fish and Wildlife Service as well. And the agencies are really partnering together to get the data and determine where the populations are at in terms of their viability and in terms of whether that population is in decline or in a sink situation or whether it's thriving. So it's a win for the agencies, for the traveling public, as well as the tortoise. Because ultimately what we want for the tortoise is we want thriving populations, whether they're adjacent to our freeways or out in wilderness areas. ADOT, keeping Arizona moving.